I'm Katie and this is Katie Plays Stuff, where I play stuff for you. And today we are getting back to Resident Evil 8 The Village. Guys, I am enjoying this game so much, seriously. And I realized after I recorded it and then I edited it and then I posted it that this game is very much inspired by Resident Evil 4, which is if anything, my favorite Resident Evil game ever. I played that on my channel god knows how long ago. I have it linked down below if you guys want to watch that extremely old and cringy playlist where I didn't know how to edit my videos at all. Um, so I realized that this game is heavily inspired by that. Uh, not only because there's a merchant in this game, also, apparently there's like hidden things around, like, I mean, I guess they had hidden things in Resident Evil 7, like the uh, the little bobblehead guys, but um, apparently there's hidden things around the village. Uh, what else? I, I realized when that whole horde of like werewolf lichen things are attacking you and then all of a sudden they stop fighting you and then they just run away. It was kind of like the village part in Resident Evil 4, where they hear like the bell ringing and all of a sudden they all just like disperse. And so I'm really seeing like some similarities and I'm, I love it. I really love it. So in the last part, we are playing as Ethan Winters. Mia is a literal psycho wife. Uh, she met her demise very quickly and our baby was stolen by none other than Chris Redfield. Um, so looking into this story, apparently Chris moved us to England or something like that. Like he, he helped us get to England to like keep us safe. And then he came in and Ethan was like, Chris, what are you doing here? So it's like as if they know each other well. Um, and then he kills Mia and then he takes the baby, but he doesn't kill me. So I don't know where this story is going. I am so excited to find out what's about to happen. Uh, right now we're running through this crazy village. We just met this old ass lady who is like the witch from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Like, I, I do not know what's going on but let's find out. So I heard that there are typewriters in this game, apparently, and that's how you save the game. So I really hope that I don't have to play this entire game over again. That would be lovely. Let's see. Okay, it, it left me exactly where I was, so maybe the typewriters aren't all that important. Um, all right, you guys. Actually, I think it started me right before you talked to the lady. Is the late ah the lady's right there? Okay, so that gives me a chance to actually walk back here because um, I realized that after the whole cutscene with all the werewolves, I did not look around again. Um, although someone in the comments did tell me that you come back to this place eventually, so things that I don't get finished now I could do later. Um, so that's exciting. So the village is very prevalent in this game, thus the title of the game. But, uh, I'm just gonna look around real quick and just make sure that there's nothing crazy that I missed. Um, I know that there was, like, a lockpick thing that I was supposed to pick, but I never found a lockpick for that. Was that in here? No, it wasn't in here. But it was in a building just like this. And, um, and I need a lockpick for it, so hopefully I find something around. Guys, I'm also recording this. Ooh, this is creepy. It's locked. What the hell? Is this- that's a fetus! Um, I'm recording this, guys, on the oldest TV imaginable, because for some reason the TV that I usually have right here will not work. Like, I, I tried to film it, and uh, it, I just- I couldn't get it to work. I don't know what's going on. Like, my headphones weren't working with it. It was a whole thing. Uh, so I am filming with a TV that I got from my high school boyfriend <laughs> when I was 17 years old. So, uh, Caleb, if you're out there, wherever you are watching this, I got your TV. <laughs> Which is so weird. <laughs> but I still got it. I still got a PCU. I have not talked to him in years, so I hope he is doing well. He probably does not know that I have a YouTube channel. <laughs> okay. I'm not finding anything. Oh wait, let me look up here. I think I ran into this building very quickly and didn't get a chance. Oh, I can't even go in. I don't think I got a chance to look around. 
Also, I'm extremely lost. I don't know how to get back to that original area I was in. Attack flower bags to create a cloud? Oh, that's cool! I just wasted that one, but that's cool. Will it work with little bags of flour? Nope. Only the big ones. There's a lot of kids' toys everywhere, too. We saw a cradle in one of the last houses. And some kids' toys in this one. Alright. So we successfully went through that house. I guess there was nothing in this one. And this is the ladder that you can't climb? Oh, you can climb it! the damn roof. There's nothing up here. I don't think. That's weird. There is absolutely nothing up here. Okay. But, uh, so I guess this is the village, folks. And our map, which I did not look in the last video, um, there, there's a journal too? Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is our map. It tells us the buildings that we have been in and the buildings that we have not been in. So apparently I haven't been to this bridge area here. Um, so that's going to help me out a lot. Let's check out this journal. We got files, tips, and a diary. Uh, February 9th, dawn, some forest. It should have been a night like any other, but then Chris Redfield came in and destroyed our family. He took Rose away, shot Mia right in front of me. I was knocked out, and now I'm in some forest in the middle of nowhere. What the hell is going on here? Okay, I love this. I love the fact that I can read this. Um, mission briefing. Eliminate target, recover body, secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Okay, I did read that already. And, uh, so, open the map to check object objectives. So I didn't know that I had that option. Um, the journal. Read Ethan's diary of events and information you gather throughout the story. Cool. Cool, cool. So what's our objective on our, on our map? East Old Town. I don't see an objective. What you talking about? Well, let's keep going, folks. I have held us here long enough. Apparently, there's also these weird locked doors we can't get into yet. Alright, lady. In life and in death, we give glory. I'm just gonna skip this part. Uh. <laughs> Rose is here? Well, obviously, because we're here. Um, so, I guess there's some lady named Mother Miranda who took our baby here and now they're coming and like Rose is in grave danger and now they're coming I don't know who they are but um I'm terrified but uh we gotta find this mother Miranda person I guess what is this Anybody home? You're just gonna leave these candles lit on the floor? It seems a little dangerous. Uh, oh, great lichens, the fabled monster of wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh. May they come to tear us apart. Okay. <laughs> that sounds like a great prayer. So they want the wolves to come and tear their flesh apart? Is that it? Why would you want that? An easy to pick lock, huh? I need a lock pick, guys. Maybe we can craft them eventually. This is not what I'm looking for. What is the damn button? Okay, here we are. Actually, let's put these over here. And put our bullets. 
handgun ammo. We got a lot of handgun ammo. I feel like now I want to be looking for, like, trophy things and, like, things to shoot, just like in Resident Evil 4, you know? Like, up in the trees. Okay, view map. Um, so that's here. So the house we were in, it says that I need a lockpick for that. This tells us that we need an insignia key here. Oh, okay, there's our objective there. It says look for Rose. Yes, locked. Locked from the other side. Statue. Can't go this way. This needs some kind of other item. All right, we probably need a crank for that. Can I get in any of these doors? What does this say? Castle Demesco. Dimi Dimitrescu. Okay. Is that way. And the ceremony site is that way, which is locked. So I guess we are headed towards the castle. Which, I didn't play the demo, so I don't know what that's like. We offer these goats of warding to protect the village and its people. Any who break them shall feel Mother Miranda's wrath. They're like bobbleheads. It's, oh, okay, cool. I love that. I really don't want to feel Mother Miranda's wrath, though, but so I guess we're looking for fucking goat bobbleheads in this game. <laughs> okay. What do we got? There's something in there. I don't know what it is. Castle Guess this leads to the castle. All right, it looks like I'm gonna need some items for that. Let me put something this way. Let me just go over here quick. This is probably locked too. Okay, I need a key for this one. It's decorated with a six-winged being. Okay, six wings. Alrighty. Oh, it's another one of these. So hopefully the crank that we find we can keep with us and use on all of these wells. Did you hear that? I thought I heard a bobblehead. I did! Hell yeah! Alright, I gotta just listen for that noise. I knew I heard it. Hello? Do you guys see this? We found one. A typewriter. Hell yeah! Even though apparently saving is really not that important, because I didn't even save my game last time. What do we got here? Uh, should disaster fall upon the village, seek out the crests. One is in the care of the church, and the other is at Louisa's house. So Louisa is where we need to get to, because she was the one that was on the radio. So there's a crest in the church, and there's a crest at Louisa's. Cool. Can I keep this, or? Nah. So there's the crest. I feel like once I pick this up, something bad is gonna happen.
who I've been seeing this lady's picture all over YouTube. I don't know who she is. She might be Mother Miranda, but I've been seeing, I don't know who the hell that is, but I've been seeing this lady's picture a lot, and that's really creepy. Okay, I got it. I'm scared. Uh, what is that? Scarecrow. Okay, let's go put the crest in the door before something bad happens. Does this even go here? Oh, yeah. Alright, one more to go at Louise's house. Wherever that is. Another door up here that I probably can't get into. Nope. So many locked doors. Flower bags. Let me take out my knife just in case I need to do that. Ah! Oh no. My aiming was so terrible. What are you? What is this? A direct contact mine. Okay. Interesting. Who's out there? Ready to get killed today! Oh my god, there's two of them. My aiming is shit. My gun sucks. Oh no. Alright, maybe I should get their attention, run into the house, close the door behind me. That might be my best bet. Alright, follow me! Hello? Oh, I think it's coming. It's gonna pop out. Fuck me. <clears throat> Alright, are you gonna kill me or not? Uh, I feel like it's not gonna come out until I actually go in. Scrap, shotgun ammo. Okay, let's. I... Yeah, I crafted more of that. Cool. Is my shotgun filled? I'm so nervous, guys. <laughs> uh. Yes, I am not a good shot, as we know. But I will complete the game. I will just not complete it efficiently. <laughs> what is that? More rusted scrap. Oh, I'm scared. Yeah, I'll take out my shotgun. Gotcha! Woo! Come at me, bro. Where are you at? Where are you? Where is he? Uh. Shit, I can hear him and I cannot see him at all. There you are. Sorry, I'm trying to get a 
headshots and not do it so well. Oh my god! Shit. There we go. Is that it? Who else wants a piece of this? I think we're good. I just don't want to waste all my shotgun shells, because I don't know how scarce fucking ammo is in this game. Maybe it's really easy to come by. I don't know. Give me that rusted scrap. Ah, uh, what do we got over here? Ooh. I'm on a mission to find the goat bobbleheads. I probably missed a ton of them without even realizing it. I'm sure there's one in the middle of this field somewhere. Okay, that way. Close the door! Oh my god, that scared me. Hey, what are you doing here? Stay back. Please, don't hurt us. Whoa. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just glad to see normal people at last. Have you seen any other survivors? No. They're all in Louise's house. And she's not answering and the gate is locked. Quiet girl. He's an outsider. Oh. Shit, we're sitting ducks in here. Can your old man walk? No. One of the monsters cut him. He's lost a lot of blood. We have to get into Louise's Shh, house. Quiet. There must be a way inside. Stay here. Be quiet. And don't move until I get those gates open. <coughs> oh my god. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> uh, I thought he cut you. Didn't, like, kill your lungs and have you smoke in a pack a day. But, uh, anyway. Um... So, I guess since I'm an outsider, they don't trust me, but for some reason, like, she was like, quick, close the door, and then as soon as she saw me, she was like, <gasps> so it's like, maybe there's something about me, and like, that's why they took my baby and everything, you know, like, maybe they know something that I don't, right? It's possible. Another one of these things. Come on, it's clear. Uh, hurry, hurry. <sighs> Took your damn time. Excuse me? You're welcome. It's been like 20 seconds. <sighs> He's not used to relying on other people. I'm sorry. We'll be safe in here, won't we? Safer I don't here know. Than out there, that's for sure. Hey, do you know anything about what's going on around here? It doesn't make any sense. Mother Miranda has always protected us. Nobody's <laughs> answer. Father? <laughs> we have to get inside. This poor guy. <laughs> He's grumpy, but I feel bad for him. Uh, what? Oh, one of the crests is in here. Just... Hold on a say? bit longer. Could probably open it by removing a screw. Okay. I need a screwdriver now. There's so much blood. I don't see any really. I mean, it's not that much blood. Let's let's not go overboard. Hello? Anybody home? Maybe a familiar voice. Louisa! Open up! It's me, Elena! Stop. Shouting, you'll draw the monsters. Julian, calm down. Who's this? A friend. Stay back. <laughs> Father, for God's sake, Julian, let us in. No, 
No, they'll smell the blood. You'll endanger us all. My father will die out here. But that's not my problem. What's going on? These people want to let a dying man into our home. Come now, these people are our friends. Go on, go inside. Come now, this way. You're not from this village. Uh, no. I'm Ethan. Yulian, go make yourself useful and check the grounds. I said go! Don't go. If Elena trusts you, then so do I. Come inside, Ethan. Okay. Wait here. I'll check on the others. Do we trust this lady? Or does she secretly kill us and then eat us for meat? I don't know. Oh, it's another safe spot. We got here. Louisa, they broke in again, got more of the livestock. I don't think we'll make it through the winter at this rate. She's gonna eat me for meat. I already knew it. Ernest is still missing too. We can't find him anywhere. Has Mother Miranda abandoned us? I don't know. This way. Okay, hold on. I'm just looking through your possessions. Let's see. We got some pictures here. Can I turn the page or... I'm pressing the button it's telling me to. Lovely. Good shots. Oh. Okay, then. Is any of this important? I don't know. I don't see anything of significance, but I might be blind. Hi. Nice place you got here. Come inside, the others are waiting. What the fuck is this? Yeah. Outsiders, you're gonna get us all killed! Right, Anton. He helped Leonardo and Elena. We were doing fine by ourselves. Barely. Please, Ethan, take a seat. Is this all that's left? From your entire village? All that's left? All that's left? There is no one left! A worthless invalid? A stupid, wailing bitch! And you! You drag a bloody man and an outsider in here like it's nothing? And expect to be all safe? There is no safe! Every sorry bastard out there has been ripped in half. But tomorrow? <sighs> tomorrow we'll all be dead. Just like her damn husband. <laughs> Put a sock in it, Roxana! That's enough! This house has protected my family for generations. And drunk or not, you are all welcome and safe in here. Whatever. Can someone please tell me what the hell is going on here? We don't know. One day we were a quiet, devout village and the next, the monsters came and attacked us. And they, they kept coming. Wait, Louisa. Where is your husband? Did they? No. N no, he, he is out there. Somewhere. He, he, he went to get help. Yes, yes, that's, that's it. He, he went to fetch help. Let us pray for him, for all of us. Good idea. Come, gather. Okay, I feel bad for talking shit about Louisa. She seems kind of nice. This Anton fellow, though, is a little rude. Great ones, hear our voice. Together as one in reverence, we call on thee within the endless dark to deliver us into fate's hands. As the midnight moon rises on black wings, so we make our sacrifice and await the light at the end. In life and in death, we give you glory, Mother Miranda. We'll sacrifice. Now, the tea should be ready. 
Come help me, Elena, please. That prayer, I've heard it before. There was an old woman near the graveyard. You mean that hag? <laughs> Some bitch is crazy as a bag of rats. There is wisdom in her devotion, though. And I hope it protected her as it shall protect us. <laughs> did the right thing. Elena, Elena, no! There's nothing you can do! Papa! This entire place is collapsing! No. Dang! You couldn't save him. He was already gone. Leave me alone! No, we're getting out of here, together. He's like, my wife just died. I'm kind of lonely. You look like lucky. you could be the mother for my baby. <laughs> um, wow, that was insane. Uh, I love how everybody was talking shit about how they let me, an outsider, in. And uh, that was the dude that ended up killing everybody. So, wow. Also, the guy outside was completely right. They're like, you should not let this man in. <laughs> And uh, he's a smart man, and he's alive right now, so you know what? Good for him. Anyway, there's nothing in there. Are you okay, Elena? It's gonna be fine. We got Katie on our side. Katie and Ethan to the rescue, don't you worry. Let's check this place out, see what we can get. Hopefully we find a lockpick or something. Bag of money? 500 Lee? How do you pronounce it? I can't pick it up. Lay? 500 Lay? Take the screwdriver out of the key ring if you need it. Where's the key ring? Truck key. Examine the item in more detail to find some new clues. Okay, so there is probably the screwdriver there. There we go. Cool. I don't like the noises in this game. It gets me nervous. <laughs> she got a lot of fucking food in here. Okay. We got a key to the truck, so that's cool. Damn, the fire's moving fast. <sighs> Let's get in here. What are you thinking? Step back. We can bust out with this. Let me back up again. The fire. There isn't any time. We gotta try. 
Nowhere to go but up. Grab one. Hurry. Let's move. Right, let's worry. go. And try we'll not to Atlanta. breathe in the smoke. I know. Thank you, Ethan. <coughs> you're kind. I know. I hope your family is safe. I do too. <laughs> Ethan! Come on. He's always breaking shit. There. That's our way out. Oh, thank God. But what then? The village is still full of monsters. We can't fight them. There's too many. Hey. Hey, don't talk like that. We'll find a safe house to put you in until I can find my daughter. My hunch is she's in that old castle. No. That place is full of nothing can we but leave blood the building? and death. And I don't want to be alone while you're... Father? Ooh. Elena, no. That's not him. Not Dude, anymore. you shot him with a shotgun. <laughs> he said my name. Father! Wait, it's not safe. Elena, no. <laughs> Stay there! Come on! Give me your hand! Elena, please. Ethan, go! Save your daughter! Elena, don't give up! Reach for me! What is wrong Damn with you? It. Oh my god. That was so unnecessary. That was extremely. Why is everyone dying on me? <laughs> it's extremely unnecessary. This is, this is just too much. He was like, damn, she was cute. <sighs> You've got to be kidding me. Why is everyone dying on me? <laughs> I just I don't get it. Uh, I'm sorry, Ethan. I don't get it either. You know what? I kind of like Ethan. The first game, I didn't really know about him, but he's just an average dude just trying to survive. And like, I care about him. I want to see him succeed. Mad. Why the fuck is this happening again? Didn't that hurt? <sighs> Shit. You know, fingers. <laughs> All right, let's escape. I wonder if there's something in there. No. Okay. Well, let's keep going. But let's open this first with my trusty screwdriver. And we got the demon crest. Nice. Who's there? Oh, stop! Mother Miranda! Hey! Oh no! <gasps> That's Mother Miranda. Who, who was... What was that? Did she just disappear? Or is she still walking? I can't tell. Oh my god, Mother Miranda's scary. Let me, uh... Look at my map real quick. Okay, there's a bunch of houses that I still don't have stuff for. I wonder... Now, this specifically says lockpick. So, I'm sure I can't use a screwdriver on it. Hmm. Is there anything in this house? I cannot believe Alana just died like that. Like an idiot. Like, her dad is literally crazy. <sighs> And she's like, oh, let me throw myself into the flames. I don't understand. I wonder if I would do the same. Because, like, you know, what would you do in that situation if you were actually there? Like, if my dad just became a werewolf and killed a bunch of people. And then was like, Katie, like, what would I do? <sighs> anyway. Jump. Did I hear a bobblehead? No. It's probably this jingly ass with these bones. 
I swear I heard a bobblehead. Hmm. I guess not. Oh shit, yeah. it's that lady again! Yes. <laughs> Death has visited them all. <laughs> Is that all you have to say? You just gonna stand there? Hello? This is extremely weird. <laughs> uh, I went in here, right? I think the typewriter's in here. Yeah. Okay, let's save it. All right, you guys. We have been recording for apparently 42 minutes. I'm gonna keep going because I feel like not a lot has happened. Maybe I just play extremely slow. I hope you guys are enjoying the longer videos. I think my last video was an hour, so I could try to stick to that time frame. I don't know, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going. Oh, turn it. We did it! We're going to the castle! Nothing but blood and death. Huh? Damn, this atmosphere is so good. from the other side. Well, well. Who the hell are you? Didn't think anyone was left. You must be pretty tough. Huh. Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck is going Oh, on? you're not local. Even better. <laughs> 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 Mother Miranda's gonna love you. <laughs> There's magic in this game? But you're whining. We're almost there. <laughs> Like, I understand there's werewolves, but there's, like, literal magic? Like, magicians in this game? The man is of no real use to anyone else, and my daughters do so love entertaining foreigners. <sighs> Furthermore, I can assure them to entrust the more What the fuck is this? My daughters and I are delivered to the Way ugly if I want to see! <laughs> He's away! Don't you shut the fuck up! What? Where? You mean you'll screw around with him in private? And where's the fun in that? Give him to me, and I'll put on a show that everybody can enjoy. Oh, so gauche. What do we care for bread and circuses? The man thing's suffering is assured. Yeah, gag, yeah, if a man's dick is cut off in the castle, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I've heard all your arguments. Some of you were less persuasive than others, but I've made my decision. Heisenberg, the man's fate is in your hands. Mother Miranda, I must protest. Heisenberg is but a child, and his devotion to you is questionable. Give the mortal to me, and I will ensure he is ready. Shut your damn heart! And don't be a sore loser! You'll find your food somewhere else. Quiet now, child. Adults are talking. I'm the child. You're the one who's arguing with Miranda's decision. You wouldn't know responsibility if it was welded oh, to Oh, keep glory! Hand. One day your head might actually pick your ego! Fight, fight, hey, fight, don't fight, I get a fight, say in this? Silence! <laughs> My decision is final. There will be no argument. Remember from whence you came. Thank you. Huh. Lycans! 
And gentlemen, we thank you for waiting. And now let the games begin. Uh, let's see what you're doing. Ethan Winters. Get ready. No, wait! <laughs> Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Showtime! What is happening? Guys, Jesus what is happening? Christ. This is a damn nightmare. Run for your life. Guys, guys, I have no fucking idea. I don't know what Resident Evil has become. This is insane. And who is this guy? No, no! How did that not kill me? You're still alive? In oh, shit. oh my god, Ethan's about to be a fucking Jill sandwich! Okay, maybe not that way. Um... Well? Maybe this way? Can't- Okay. Uh, what do I do, people? Oh, right here. Oh my god. <laughs> my word. You truly are as strong as they say. Oh, you don't think I'd let you get away, did you? Break it! Gotta keep Dada and into oh, pain. Okay, okay, oh shit! So now it's time for the beautiful, blood-soaked grand finale! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing like fresh American ground beef! <laughs> Wait, do those freaks have Rose? Guys, I'm in like literal shock right now. <laughs> I, I don't even know what to say because this game is surpassing all of what I thought it was going to be. And I kind of like it a little bit. I mean, it's very interesting. I love when a game surprises me. I really don't know what's gonna be around like the next corner. That is insane. Uh, so I don't have much commentary for you guys to talk about because I, I don't really know what to say because for one, I don't know anybody's names except for apparently Mother Miranda was the one with all the wings and she's like magic and then there's this guy, I forgot his name, who's also magic. And then there's the really tall lady, who's probably magic. And then there's the big troll looking one, and a little doll one. And then like, the big guy with the hammer. There's so many characters. <laughs> I'm baffled at this. Uh, I hope all of you are thinking exactly what I'm thinking, which is what the fuck is going on? I really want all of you guys' thoughts on this. I don't want any spoilers, obviously, if you played the game, but like your first initial thoughts when you started playing this, like, please tell me, because I'm so intrigued. <laughs> okay, well. Let's, uh... 
keep going. Oh, do I have my guns? Yes, I do. Okay. Apparently, through all of that, we still got to keep our weapons. Wait, I think I hear... a bobblehead. Right? Am I wrong? I hear it over here. Oh, here it is. Can I do it with my knife? No. Alright. Alright, I've been recording for almost an hour. I'm gonna keep going, I guess, until the next typewriter or whenever I think I should. <gasps> it's the merchant! Uh, I've been waiting for you, Mr. Winter. How do you know my name? Anyone who is anyone has heard of the likes of you. A hero searching for his daughter. Though I must say that castle arouses suspicion. Yeah, and so do you. <laughs> I am but a humble merchant. Here? Oh, forgive my manners. Call me the Duke. Now to business. Weapons, ammunition, healing salves, Anything you desire, I can provide. <laughs> I love this. So, just like in Resident Evil 4, there's a merchant here. And he needs some fucking shoes, because his fat ass feet I don't want to look at. If it's just looking, window shop away. Okay. You can I've buy... gotten some new stock. Oh, I haven't even seen your original stock, so I wouldn't have known if it was new or not, would I? <laughs> Okay, we got supplies, gunsmithy, and the duke's purse. Okay, so here we got um, extra baggage, recipe for shotgun ammo, so I can make my own ammo. Cool, cool. First aid. Hair trigger. What is this? Oh, it's a part for my gun, a customizable part. And more stuff. Oh, okay. So this is all. It's different parts. Alright, gunsmith. We can upgrade our weapons! <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna cry. Wow. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, what, um, so that's why we have money, so we can upgrade our weapons, dude. Alright, I definitely want to upgrade my, um... Sorry, but I do not give discounts. Oh, I didn't... Oh, it's $6,000? Oh, did I already, already upgrade it? No, I don't think I did. $6,000? Holy shit, these are expensive. Okay, well, we can't do that This is now. all an investment, Ethan. Okay, and then we sell stuff to him here? Or do I buy this off of him? No, this is all the stuff that I have in my own thing. So, sell those crystal Hard times, Ethan. Cool. I still don't have enough money for anything. But I love this. A good deal, if I say so myself. Well, that was unexpected. I don't know guys, after the shit that I've been through in this game, that baby is dead to me. I would not be walking into this castle trying to get my baby here. back. <laughs> I mean, but good for Ethan. I'm, I'm proud of him for <sighs> doing what he's gotta do. He's a good father. I cannot say that I would be the same. <sighs> Oh my gosh, this is just like Resident Evil 4. I am living for this game right now. 
January 5th, Rednick, delivery of one male, three females. January 28th, Mother Miranda, meeting with Mistress Dimitrescu. Uh, February 1st, the Duke business discussions. Okay. Three daughters, Bella, Cassandra, and Daniela. Daniela. some money nothing happens this looks like an elevator locked from the other side <clears throat> Like this place. This is terrifying. Mask the angel's blinded gaze. What did that say? Looking for Rose. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> These must be the three sisters. <laughs> Jesus. Man blood. Excuse me. <laughs> 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 Are my legs okay? Mother? I bring you fresh prey. You are so kind to me, daughters. Oh no, it's that lady. Ah, now, let's take a look at him. Well, well, Ethan Winters. You escaped my little brother's idiot games, did you? Let's see how special you are. <laughs> yes, mother. Yes, mother. <laughs> Please don't chop off my penis. Please don't chop off my penis. Hmm. Starting to go a little stale. Then let's devour his man flesh quickly, Mother. But I am the one who captured him. Now, now, daughters. First, I must inform Mother Miranda. But later, well... There will be enough for everyone. <laughs> Udama! Hey, hey, wait. Ah! 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 <laughs> oh, be careful what you wish for, Ethan Winters. <laughs> <laughs> She is so wait, wait, wait. fucking tall. Whoa, 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 buddy, what are you doing? <laughs> Am I just dangling here by my hands? Oh my god. Fuck! Ah! Ah! crazy witches. I don't get the juice. I don't know how this magical juice 
just heals our hands. But I also don't understand how those girls just turned into flies and flew away. <laughs> what the fuck? Is there a typewriter in here? Crimson glass? Okay. Some weird lever thing. What the fuck, guys? <laughs> Okay, is there a typewriter though? Because I gotta stop this video. What does the map look like? Easy to pick lock. I don't have any lock picks. from the other side. <sighs> That's scary. The eye ring. fluid <laughs> crystal fragment I'm guessing that's something that we can sell <laughs> look at that map okay now I'm back in here I was already in here too. Um. <laughs> Where have they taken Rose? What is going on? Okay, these are gonna be all pieces we're gonna have to get, I'm sure. I'm just trying to find a damn typewriter. There has to be one in, like, this main lobby, right? I don't know, you guys, but I think I'm gonna keep recording anyway, because I am interested in the story. Uh, so I'm just gonna pause it for now, and I will probably end up recording another one of these shortly. Um, but damn, this game is crazy so far. Please give me your thoughts, your opinions in the comments down below. Um, no spoilers, please. I, I'm really, really enjoying this. I would play the shit out of this game if I didn't have to record it and like put on makeup and like talk to you guys. Like I probably would have beaten it all in one night. Um, I'm really enjoying it. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.